back to my channel. Happy holidays, you guys. As we all know, Christmas is about a week away. Today is December 15th um, on a Friday, so we are about a week away from Christmas, you guys. So I have finally got everything delivered for baby girl's Christmas gifts. So for those of you that don't know, we have an eight-year-old and three-year-old boys and a one-year-old daughter. So today I'm just gonna show you guys everything that I got my one-year-old today. Um, now, if I were to show you guys everything that I got all three of my kids in one video, I feel like that would be a super long video. Plus, I'm still waiting on some items to be delivered for my boys. Um, so definitely stay tuned for a video on what I got my eight-year-old and three-year-old boys coming soon to you, you guys. So that will be going up next week before Christmas. Um, because like I said, I am still waiting on some gifts for them to get delivered. Today, I'm just gonna show you guys everything that I got my one-year-old. You guys, I am so excited for Christmas. Christmas is my absolute favorite time of the year. I just love buying my kids gifts and seeing their faces light up and just how happy they are. Just watching them be creative and imaginative when they're playing. It is just, it warms my heart, you guys. Um, but I am most excited that I actually got to go and shop down the girl aisles, you guys. I have two boys and I have waited so long to buy all of the girly pink Barbie doll things. So super, super excited. Now I have been stocking up on Christmas gifts since July, just buying things here and there. Um, now baby girl, our daughter, um, her name is Brooklyn. For those of you who are new here, her name is Brooklyn. Um, but we just call her baby girl. That is her nickname. It just kind of stuck. Dad called her that when she was born and that's just kind of the nickname that has stuck with her. So we just call her baby girl. Um, but I think she has like 11 presents. Now she did have around the same amount as the boys, um, but I went ahead and saved a little bit for Valentine's Day. Um, for those of you that don't know, I do make holiday baskets for my kids for every major holiday. Um, so Valentine's Day is the next holiday that is coming up. I don't do baskets for New Year's because it's literally right after Christmas. And I think they have, they have enough after Christmas to play with through the new year. Um, so I did save a couple things for her Valentine's Day basket, and then I was also able to save a couple things for her St. Patrick's Day basket. Um, I did also save some things for their Christmas Eve boxes. That is a tradition that I do with my kids every single year. I make them up a Christmas Eve box. Every year could look a little bit different, but usually I try to get them some Christmas jammies, a Christmas book, a Christmas movie, a toy, and a treat. Um, and put it in a box for them or a bag. Um, this year is going to look a little bit different, um, but I am thinking about filming what I got my kids for their stocking stuffers and their Christmas Eve boxes. So if I do end up doing that video, definitely stay on the lookout for it. It will be coming up to you this week, you guys. Um, so without further ado, um, my three-year-old Brody, he is sleeping right now, and my eight-year-old Benjamin and baby girl are having snacks and watching a movie, so hopefully that's going to keep them occupied so I can get through this video, you guys. Um, like I said, we're a week away. I haven't even got stocking stuffers, stuffers yet. I don't have enough Christmas wrapping paper or tape, so we actually need to go to the store tonight or this weekend and get the last of everything that we need. Um, so anyways, without further ado, I'm going to show you guys everything that I got our one-year-old. So starting here, now I want to play some of the sounds and stuff for you guys, but I don't know if she's going to hear it and start crying and wanting to come out here. So I'll try it with one thing and we'll see how it goes. But when we were in the store, all three of them actually fell in love with this thing and really liked it. So this is the DJ Bouncing Star by Fisher Price. Um, so let's see what it says. It has lights, learning, and bopping tunes to get baby dancing. Um, it has 75 plus song sounds, tunes, and phrases. It teaches alphabet colors, counting opposites, develops gross motor skills, fine motor skills, imaginative play, and following directions. Um, and here's what it looks like on the back. So I'm gonna go ahead and press it. Hopefully it's not too loud. Um, I don't even know what to press. Record and remix. When I turn red, change something Hello. Hello. Okay, that's pretty cool. <laughs> okay, so hopefully 
it'll stop talking and it won't continue talking. Um, but that is really cool. So you can record your voice and it turns it into a song and then there's all kinds of other things that it does. I thought that this will definitely keep her entertained. I think it's going to keep all three of them entertained because when we were in the store, all three of them were all over it. So I got that for her. I think she's absolutely going to love that. If you know baby girl, then you know that baby girl loves her baby dolls. She absolutely loves baby dolls. When we go down the baby doll aisle, her face lights up, literally leaping out of that shopping cart and trying to grab as many baby dolls as she can. And it's hard to tell her no because she will start crying and throwing a fit if we go down the baby doll aisle and we go past it without getting her anything. So sometimes we can give her something in the car and occupy her and then she'll forget about it and we don't have to buy it but sometimes we do have to end up buying her one. Um, so anyways, I seen these and they're so, so cute. I had to get them. I actually did get a couple other ones, but they haven't came in yet. Um, so I got her the baby Rapunzel and it comes with a little bottle here. She's so cute. I don't think they make any noise or anything like that. Um, no, so they don't make any noise but they are so so cute she loves her babies you guys and she is so cute because she'll literally grab her baby and put it over her back and pat them and go mama mama it is so cute it is the cutest thing ever so anyways i got her this one i got her the baby rapunzel and then i also got her the baby ariel you guys how stinking cute how stinking cute oh my gosh she's gonna love this this one also comes with the bottle and then on the back it actually shows you all of the other ones that they have so they have Belle and they have Tiana. So I did buy her the baby Tiana, but it hasn't came in yet. So that is something else that I am going to be adding to her Christmas gifts. Um, so that'll make it 12 actually. Um, but yeah, so I got her these cute little baby dolls. Oh my gosh, she's going to love these, you guys. Oh, we actually also got her a baby stroller too. So that didn't come in yet either. Um, but I will pop that up here on the screen, the baby Tiana, and then I'm also gonna pop up the stroller as well. Um, so we did get her those, but they just haven't came in yet, um, but I know she's gonna love the stroller, putting her little baby dolls in it and wheeling around in it. So we got her some baby dolls. Uh, another thing that I got her is this Little People Time for Tea with Belle Fisher Price set. She is absolutely going to love these. So it comes with Belle and you have Mrs. Teapot and Chip it has a little table, an extra cup, a cupcake, got some plates and spoons. So, so cute. She is going to love this. So I went ahead and got her that. We actually have quite the collection of the little people things um, and she loves playing with them. So I just wanted to add to it and now we can finally buy all of the little girly little people stuff so I seen this and I had to grab it they actually have a lot of other things um so they do have like the princesses the little people princesses um which I did get her those it's a pack of just the little people princesses but I'm gonna take that apart and put it in her stocking for her stocking stuffers and then they also have this aerial one which is really cute that I wanted to get but I didn't end up getting it I was like that's something that we can get later down the line for something else so got her that and then to go along with all of her little peoples. Um, I think actually her and Brody are gonna both get a kick out of this, but this is the Fisher Price. Little people, friends together, playhouse, you guys. Oh my gosh, so, so cute. So I used to have like the farm growing up. Um, I never had the house though, which is really, really cool. So it comes with three of the little people here. It looks like you have like a little tree swing. I'm gonna show you guys like a more up close and personal view. So I'm gonna bring the camera down. Okay, so you have the bathroom here. You have a little bathtub, a little sink, a little step stool, the toilet that actually flushes. That's pretty cool. And Yay! then in, in here you have some beds. The bed slides over. Down here you have the kitchen. So the fridge opens up. You have a little um, oven, which is pretty cool. And then this little thing, you have a little table set here, a little couch. Um, the light turns off and on, which is pretty cool. And then you have some different stages here. So I think it might do different things if you put it on the different stages. So that's actually really, really cool. Um, 
I think that's like a pool. It is a pool. So it says you're invited to our pool party, which is pretty cool. So it comes with a little pool. Um, let's take a look at the back. So here's just more of an overview of what it looks like. Um, here's some other things that we have. So we actually have this recycling truck, which would be pretty cool to have some creative play. You know, the garbage man coming around by the house. And here is the farm. We used to have it. I actually ended up selling this. Um, after Benjamin, but I'm thinking about buying a new one. All right, so I also got her these Trolls Band Together dolls. I've never seen them so huge. Um, I'm not sure if it's out already. I think it is. So these are from the Trolls 3 movie. All of us love the Trolls movies. They're so cute. Um, but I've only seen them in like little tiny figures, like about that tall. So when I seen these, I was like, oh, definitely have to grab this. And I think I got all three of these for like, like 15 or 20 dollars you guys which is a really good steal i wonder if it says oh so it does say their name so we have spruce bruce queen poppy and floyd so she is going to love those um she has watched the trolls movie and the trolls like little tv series and she loves it um she also has some of the little mini figures as well so i know she's gonna love this so i had to pick that up for her so i got her that and then I also got her this Leapfrog Shapes and Sharing Picnic Basket. She absolutely loves play food and playing in the little play kitchen and making food and bring, bringing it to us so we can eat it. It's so cute. So I got her this. I thought that she would love that. Um, so on the back here, it comes with the basket. It has a little blanket and then you have all kinds of little food that actually fit in the little shape sorter here. You've got some cups and some forks. And let's see, it makes noise. Maybe I have to turn it, oh yeah, I have to turn it on. So I really, really like that. That opens up. So I'm going to turn that back off. So she tells you what to put in her basket, such as, hey, she wants the sandwich. So you would put the square sandwich into the square shape sorter and it would go in. So that is really, really fun to teach her her, cha her shapes, um, fine motor skills. So that is really fun. I'm sure Brody will also love this. Um, I think they have this in purple. And I want to say in green, but I'm not sure. I know they have different colors for, you know, corresponding to, you know, if you have a boy or a girl, which is pretty cool. And I seen the pink one and that was like, have to grab it. So got her that. And then if you guys don't know, like I said, she loves baby dolls, you guys. But her favorite baby dolls are the cry baby dolls. She loves those things. She even watches the TV show on Netflix. If you haven't seen the show, check it out. It's on Netflix. I'm not sure if it's on any other platform, but it's a super cute show. So she already has a couple of the cry baby dolls, but these are the crawling cry babies. Says that this one's name is Miley. So, so cute. So it says it crawls and giggles. Press here. Oh my god, she is going to freaking flip when these things are crawling around the house. That is so cute. So it looks like it can sit up as well. Um, I think you can, all of the crybabies, you can put water in the back of their head and the water will come out of their eyes. Um, but I don't do that for her. Um, but, you know, for those of you that would want to, um, you can have, you have that option. So it also looks like she cries and laughs. Um, it says that there's 30 plus baby sounds so that is really cool so i think she's gonna love that um it also shows that there's a game here that you can download on your phone or your pad so that's pretty cool so i got her this miley one and then i also got her this one and this one's name is jenna so we've got two of the crawling crybaby dolls you guys she's gonna love these things Right, I'm trying to get through this because she's already crying back there and she's like probably done with her snacks. Um, also got her this Peppa Pig checkup case set. So this is just like a little doctor set. So this is the case um, and inside you have some doctor accessories. So, you know, it comes with like a shot, a band-aid, a little thermometer, all kinds of little medicine and things like that. So all of the kids love to play doctor so they're gonna love this and to go with this you guys i got 
the corresponding Peppa Pig checkup center. Oh my gosh. I seen this and I was like, yeah, we're getting this. We're getting this. My husband was like, no. And I was like, yes. But as you can see, we ended up getting it. Um, so I thought this was so, so cool. So um, it comes with like a little teddy bear here. You have like a little whiteboard um, check-in stand. You've got some x-rays. It does come with a couple of um, doctor tools, but it doesn't come with everything. So that is why I bought her the actual accessories for it. Um, so you can basically put your little animal up here. It comes with like a little scanner. Um, what does it say? It says you can scan the temperature. Um, you can x-ray the teddy bear. Um, and you can check its vitals. So I thought this was really, really cool. So this is everything that it comes with. So as you can see, it doesn't come with all of the doctor accessories. It only comes with a few things. So that's why I went ahead and got her this. So she has some extra things. And I know the boys, especially Brody, also loves Peppa Pig. So he's going to want to get on in on the action as well. And then that way, um, there will be like two ste stethoscopes and two shots that, you know, they can both play with at the same time. So anyways, I thought this was super, super cool, you guys. I'm sure that it makes noise and things like that. So I got her that. And the last thing that I think everybody's gonna love and probably fight over, probably her and Brody mainly, um, is the Gabby's Dollhouse. You guys, this is one of her favorite, favorite shows right now. Her and Brody absolutely love this show. It's on Netflix. The little girl on the show is so adorable. So I had to get her the actual dollhouse to play with. So it says it comes with 15 pieces, sounds and music, the different little rooms. Um, I think it only comes with Gabby and maybe one cat. So I did want to get her like the actual like figures of all of the different cats. So she'll have them. Um, it does show an app that you can download, which is pretty cool. And you can unlock rewards, it says. Um, so yeah, I went ahead and got her this Gabby dollhouse, you guys. Um, it says that it is over two feet tall, and as you can see, Netflix original series. So definitely check it out if you haven't already. I absolutely love this show. It's so cute. Um, so I went ahead and got her that. So this I'm actually going to put together, and when they come out on Christmas Day, this is going to be something that's already going to be set up and ready for her. Um, and then I also have gotten the boys their own, like, type of play sets for some other kind of character that you guys will see soon. Um, and I wanna have all of those play sets up and ready for them when they come out on Christmas day. So I thought that would be really, really cool. So I went ahead and got her this Gabby's dollhouse. All right, you guys. So that is everything that I got my one year old. I am super, super excited. We need to get down to the store tonight so I can grab more tape because I definitely don't have enough tape to wrap everybody's gifts. Um, I really hope that this gave you guys some inspiration as to what to get your kids. My three-year-old will love a lot of these things. I'm sure that they will be sharing almost everything here. Um, so this provides great, great gift inspiration for those of you that have kids anywhere from ages one to six, I would say. Now, I know that we are a week away from Christmas, but... I did get all of these items from Target, but like I said, you can find all of these items at Walmart. You can also find them on Amazon. Now, we actually just bought some stuff last night. Like I said today, what I am filming this is December 15th. I don't know when this video is going to go up. I am going to start editing this video as soon as I am done, um, but sometimes YouTube, YouTube takes maybe one to three days to actually upload my video, which sucks sometimes, um, but it will be up for you guys this week. Um, but we did order gifts last night, which I said, which was December 14th. And a lot, and a lot of the stuff is coming in time for Christmas. Um, and you can also still go to the stores and buy things. So, so if you are interested in any of these items, I am going to link them down below for you guys. So that way you don't have to surf around for them and find out what each item is called. All you gotta do is head down to my description box, click on the link and it will take you straight there. Now, whether you decide to order it or go in person for it is up to you, but at least it's there. You know what the toy is called and you know what to look for if you are going in the store, you guys. So I really hope that you guys enjoyed this Christmas gift guide haul. I really hope that this gave some inspiration for you guys. I really hope that you guys have a Merry Christmas. Don't forget to give this video a like. Don't forget to subscribe if you aren't already. Comment down below. I will see you guys in my next video.